are some ways we can practice or realize, oh, this is a way to get out. This is uh, an exit strategy so that we're not too uh, tunnel vision on our entry. So with exits, there's a few different ways. So first type of exit is called a fixed exit. That means that the moment you enter, you know you're gonna consistently exit the same way. So you could have like a two risk reward exit. So every single trade that you take, you're gonna exit when you're up two times more than whatever you risk. So that's one way. It's the most duplicatable way. Way less variables, there's not a lot of moving pieces. You know, every time, 2R, 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 2R. And the, the perks of doing that is that you're building discipline. Because one of the, if not the most common issue that traders have and investors is that they're, they're not disciplined at all. You keep changing things so you have different outcomes. And if you can't duplicate success, then what do you really have? So that's one way. Another option would be a variable risk reward. And this is for more my more advanced traders in the room where your technical analysis is, is on point is where, let's say for example, anybody here know what liquidity is? All right, everybody learned that today. So that's kind of like a magnet for the market. I, the, you know, institutions love to drive price to those prices and then beyond that because that's where the retail money is at. So that's a great place to exit the market. Imbalances, things like that, right? So there's a technical exit to the market as well. But the best thing that you can do, everybody in the room, is whatever you're, you, you know how you kind of just naturally have a feeling like, oh, you know what? This is the way to exit the market. Like this is the way to, to leave. And so go and test it. Experiment with it, do it on the demo. If you think, you know what? I feel like my, um, these three risk rewards are hitting all the time. Go and do that and then track 50 trades and see if you're right or not. And because the best answer you're ever gonna have is gonna be the one that's backed by evidence. Your confidence is built backed off of that more than anything.